Hey guys, uh, this is the new uh, D-Link uh, Full HD 180 degree outdoor Wi-Fi camera and uh, this is the new uh, outdoor camera and uh, it's uh, 1080p uh, it's so clear and uh, it's really nice uh, the, this DCS uh, 2670 l is uh, uh, the new uh, the newest uh, outdoor camera of my D-Link and it's the only 180 degree outdoor camera uh, they just launched this like a uh, couple of months ago so uh, and this is so easy to connect so I will teach you how to uh, to connect this but uh, the good thing about this uh, D-Link DCS 2670L is you can connect this uh, wirelessly or connect it wired so uh, I will connect this wired it's because uh, the video is more uh, flawless the motion so uh, uh, I don't want to uh, connect this uh, via uh, through wi wi Wi-Fi or wireless wirelessly uh, if you're going to connect this through uh, Ethernet cable it's more easier to connect so uh, this is the camera And uh, these are the accessories. The, the power adapter and uh, the mounting for wall mounting. So uh, this uh, this is the instruction. Well, I don't need that because I already have like this is the fifth other camera that I have, and I'm going to install this. Uh, through to my uh, carport so, uh, uh, you know this one here when you uh, when you uh, mount this you can uh, adjust this up and down or uh, you can uh, rotate it like that so before I plug this in, I would like, I will uh, insert the 32 gigabytes uh, micro SD card. This can, you can use up to 128 gigabytes of micro SD card. I used the 64 gigabytes, but it didn't work. So I tried the, 60, uh, the 32 and uh, it works. So first, I'm going to uh, plug the Ethernet cable. And then the power adapter. So uh, wait till it the LED turns green and then uh, if you don't have a, uh, a DC, DC, uh, D-Link account you have to uh, create your uh, my D-Link account and it's more easier uh, to, uh, to uh, configure or uh, connect and uh, it's free when you create the my D link account so uh, this is my D link account uh, so I already have this front door back door my living room and uh, this is different this is a DCS 2630 on my living room and my kitchen DCS to 530 on my uh, basement and 
and as in my gym basement and in my garage the DCS 2670L and the front garage is 2670L etc etc so uh, these are my uh, dinner camera so here it's it turns green now so uh, all you have to do is uh, add new camera and this uh, model doesn't have any QR code so it will ask you do you have any uh, QR code on your device or the configuration card so no and then you uh, it will uh, show you what camera do you have here so it's uh, DCS 2670L press that and then with, it will ask you to if you plug in the power adapter yes plug in the ethernet cable I already did and then wait, wait until the power LED turns solid green and it's solid green already over there and then press ready let's wait So there, uh, it will ask you uh, set a password to protect your camera. So uh, you are going to uh, enter your uh, password, admin password. So I'm going to enter my password, but sorry, I cannot show you my password. And then once you uh, enter your password, your admin password, uh, hit go for next. And then uh, and then it will say the time zone has been uh, successful. The time zone has been uh, set according to your uh, phone region setting. Any further changes can be made on device setting page. So hit OK. And then it will ask you if you do you want to add the device to my dealing to this my dealing account and yes press yes and then you just wait for for the that thing to uh but there you go so uh setup completed and then it will just ask you for more setting such as motion detection and wireless setting wi-fi camera only you can select the cameras on the device list and tap the top right icon on the live view so done so uh you can find the new uh camera that you connect over up up here uh there you go so uh, that's the camera the wide camera and then uh, over here uh, you can uh, go to setting and then you can uh, uh, change the name and then you can uh, go to uh, motion and I will just uh, do the motion setting later if you did do the motion and then you can draw you can draw the active area over there uh, and then you can adjust the sensitivity and uh, you can uh, uh, turn on the recording by motion and then press the apply button and then 
cancel and then if you want to uh, connect it connect the camera wirelessly you just enable the Wi-Fi connection which I don't want to do that I want the wired connection and then um, I, I don't uh, I'm in uh, Canada so I just uh, select the Eastern Time Canada so there so uh, my uh, let me give you the example uh, this is my front door there uh, it's night time already so uh, it uh, automatically uh, uh, switch to uh, night uh, night mode or the infrared and this is my back door yeah it's night so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to install uh, install my camera over here in this area so that I can see my uh, carport over there because it's a big carport on the uh, outside my fence it's a gate fence so uh, and this is my garage yeah there that's my garage and then uh, this is my front garage you see how wide it it, it is uh, it's very nice um, if it is uh, daytime already it will switch to colored colored mode so uh, there you have it uh, I hope you uh, you like this video and uh, uh, that's how easy to uh, connect and easy to configure this camera so uh thank you for watching see you so the camera on my front door is this one here it's it's cold there still also have a logitech camera over there so uh it's really wide this is my back door camera and hold it there. That's my uh, uh, garage uh, in my garage, and uh, this is in uh, front of my garage. And that's the new one uh, I installed right beside my. Uh, uh, garage that will uh, uh, see the carport.